How's it going, lads? Marshall here, and welcome to another Man of the Match player review. Today, we have the privilege of reviewing a lord. It is Lord Bentner. Guys, if you do want any coins, head over to footprints.com. Use that code MA9 to get yourself 5% off. Every link that you will need is in that description below. If you want any cheap MSP, PSN, or game codes, head over to g2a.com. Once again, their link is in that description below. Now, his price on Xbox is 20 to 45, on the PlayStation, 20 to 55. And at this moment in time, he is currently extinct, so he is a bastard to snipe off the market. 8 games played, 8 goals scored, 3 star skills, 3 star weak foot, medium to low work rates. His base card stats, uh, he can't look past one thing. 64 pace. You might call me a peso, but 64 pace is not good, and his acceleration is bloody terrible. 76 dribbling, but I've got to say it's very robotic. 83 shooting and 80 physical, but you've got to be careful with that physical, because he's got 89 strength, so that's fantastic, but balance... 57 and aggression 65 he is quite strong in game especially in the air but on the ground he's quite weak because his balance isn't the greatest in the world skill attributes you're looking at 83 ball control not bad 74 dribbling terrible in game anyways 87 finishing 91 head and accuracy 84 penalties 88 shot power and 81 volleys in terms of specialities and traits he has the one power header that is what you want to do with this guy. Whip the ball in the area, get the head on the ball, and just smash it into the back of the net. Yes, he can score long ranges from time to time, like you've just seen in the background, but the bread and butter with this card is get down the wing, whip the cross in, score the header with Nicholas Bentner. Job done. Good night. Sayonara. Whatever you want to say. With Nicholas Bentner, it's that easy to do in the air. What a header that was into the far corner of the net. He kind of arched his back, as you'll see on the replay, and just flicked it beyond him into the back of the net. A cracking header there from Lord Bentner himself. So in terms of pros finishing, if he's given the chance, he's given the space, he will punish you because he is a cracking finisher on this game. Yes, he will score goals, but his pace doesn't always get him into the position to score goals, even though his positioning is fantastic. He's always in space. He's always one to get in space when you're out wide he's always busting the gut to kind of get in the area to get his head on the ball and he will score headers given the chance will Nicholas Bentner his shot power is fantastic as you've just seen in the background smashing it into the back of the net and his strength especially in the air is outrageous honestly he can power off most defenders in the air win the header and just do what you want from that kind of phase in play now in terms of cones pace I'm not a pacer in this game I like players with not too much pace not over pacey but um yeah Nicholas Bentner He's just got no pace whatsoever. His acceleration is terrible, leading up to a poor top speed, and that is uh, culpable of uh, him not being that good in terms of pace. And he's dribbling. It's robotic. It's very, very bad, but he is better than he's in form. Hence, why he is getting a rating of a 7.6 and a value for coins of an 8.4. Guys, I hope you have enjoyed. If you have, smashed the hell out of that thumbs up button. It is always massively appreciated. Subscribe if you are new, and as always, I will catch you all next time.